And we're going to the next game. So I'm just going to switch over my thing. That hour long game took slightly longer than an hour. Um, <laughs> because I had to have a break and my head hurt. Um, so we are switching to the next one, which I'm just going to do my, 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 um, spiel for. So Escape 2088 is published and developed by OnScore Games. Came out on the 3rd of February, 2023. And I was lucky enough to get a code for streaming it from ID at Xbox. It is £2.49 or $2.99. It's apparently an old school point and click escape room game with modern 3D graphics. Explore a futuristic environment and use your problem solving skills to set yourself free. Careful observation of the surroundings will help you discover hidden clues, solve logic puzzles and escape in time. So let's see if we can fail another one. <laughs> It's got 10 achievements, a couple are missable, but it's a quick completion apparently, hopefully, maybe, possibly. Um, there we go. Yeah, we're doing three, three promo games today. <laughs> All right, I'm going to give it some volume. Um, this is me. Uh, so there are three chapters. What I will do is we'll do an hour and then see where we're at. Um, maybe an hour and a half. Angel escape joke, yes. So, ooh, hello, we've got an actual cursor. All right, hang on, options first. I'm just gonna increase the brightness very slightly. Timer on, timer off. Let's have the timer off. Music down, oh my God, please, my head hurts. Sensitivity. We can have, okay, 0 0.5, 0 0.6, so, okay, let's go for 0.6, right, start game, chapter one, okay, we'll do this, I'll just click in a minute, okay, so, let me just write myself a note to remind myself to send code, um, no, ask, I'm at, at code, reminder, send, I'm at code, um, I just put it in my discord, <laughs> Because otherwise I will forget. Um, but yes, I can't believe I spent 20 minutes looking around and I literally had the, the answer in my inventory. See, this is why I don't do escape rooms on my own. I always do them with at least one friend. Because there will always be a one point where I just miss something. <laughs> so, right. Okay, so this is the, this is the second game of the Joe case today. Um, as as I did say, welcome in Raiders. You just came in at, at a transition time, and thank you very much, very much, Michael, for the raid. Um, is my button working yet? Come on, come on, button. Right. Okay. Where are we, Michael? Okay. Right. So, will that work? <laughs> I mean, that also happens. Did they do a shout out or did I do it wrong? That probably did it wrong. Oh well. Let me do. I, I was trying to set up an auto command thing to do this. Um. No, I wanted to put the little banner thing up so that people had a clicky click. Uh, I did a shout out so I could see what game you were playing, <laughs> but I wanted to get the little clicky click on the top of the chat so people can click and follow. Um, yeah, see, it's like, yeah, and I, I have a button, but I obviously set it up wrong because it didn't do what I expected it to do. Um, so I need to have a look into that. <laughs> but yes, thank you very much for the raid. I do appreciate it. Uh, I feel like I'm spoiled. I got a Steph raid yesterday and I am Michael raid today. That's like, oh, so many raids. Um, so yes, so yes, we are, we are escaping, um, yes, did an escape room with you when I went to Ireland, wasn't it? I can't remember what that escape room was right now. Did we skip a section? I mean, that seems vaguely likely. I've done that before. I've also escaped by the skin of my teeth. Um, but, um, yeah, I don't tend to do them on my own. Because if I do them on my own, I sometimes just hit a brick wall. So let's see what this one is all about. Just 
screwdriver, newspaper, plug socket, oh can we stick screwdriver in the plug socket? No. <laughs> A clock that says 22.37. stuck. Oh, I picked something. What, what is that? Oh, it's a spark plug. And a screwdriver. Okay, so I need to cut the wires. Okay. Well, we don't have anything to cut the wires with as yet. Ew. What is on that plate? Do I want to know what's on the plate? Okay. 2237. No. You forgot to ask the wife for hummus. What did God made you think of hummus? <laughs> Do I want to know? There's a drawer. Let me in my drawer. Let me in. Oh, hello. There's a button. Hummus and pear chips. Okay. Okay, well, I, I hit something. Oh my gosh, it's the whole thing. I, I'm stuck in some basement, right? Okay, maybe that one will be 22.37. No, it doesn't have a thing on it. I don't think there's any game sound aside from clunks. I may have turned the... Um, the Vav Mark II, okay. Locked. Cool, but I don't have any keys yet. I, I pressed a button and it did something, but it didn't do something. Oh, hello. Can I can I have that? It's another spark plug. Um. Maybe I should give it a, a wee bit more um, music. Okay, so we've got. Okay, it's locked, yes, but also it's got a little post-it note on. Ah. Was I doing that the whole time? Okay. No. That's what it says on the clock. 22.37. Okay. Um... Where's options? Let me give it, see if there's actually any music. No, I don't actually think there's any music. I did turn it down though because the plinky plonky music was annoying me. Uh, what's that? What is that? It's a calendar! With three, four, eight, ten, twelve. Or otherwise known as March, April, August, October, December. Oh, hang on, is there anything on the back? So this is more like a traditional escape room where I can actually see what I'm picking up. <laughs> and I can inspect everything and I get lots of spark plugs, which to me is odd. But I should at least be able to see whether the drawer is something or other, I don't know. Um, Yeah, so faint. I mean, it says 22.37. It also says I need to cut this, but I don't have anything to cut it with. Um, No idea what that is. It's still a spark plug, no matter how many times I click on it. <laughs> I'd be pulling cushions off things. Um. Yes, we're, this, the the idea is escape room, escape room, escape room. I'm doing an escape room stream on... I'm, I'm starring on the ID at Xbox escape room stream at midnight. 
Um, so this is why we have a theme. Though technically the third game is not an escape room, it just looks cool. So it'll be a nice, you know... Uh, change. I feel like that draw will be important. It's a palette cleanser, yes. Uh, I did not expect... The, um... What is that? It's making a noise. Oh, I think it might just be... I don't know what that is. Um. But yeah. I'm not sure this is particularly any better than the other one. I, I feel like I can't do these on my own. I need a friend! So, feel free. Oh, hello. We've got something here. Ah, hello. Right, so we need to find one more spark plug. And we've got a calendar. And yes, we've got two four number things. None, none of them match the... Uh... And it's just... I, I want to be able to like zoom in on stuff. Um, so yeah um, but yes at least this one has slightly more range of motion and I can at least click and look at the clues I don't know why I can look at this Zero waste. Oh, hang on. Actually, no, maybe. So it's it's like four times faster and five times cooler. Zero waste, ten times instant. It's the Vav Mark II. Like two, four, five, zero could be a thing. There's also three modes of discussion. Okay, so it could be four, five, three, zero on something. Nope. Still have no idea what that thing is on top of there. Nope. I really want to zoom in on the light. It's not letting me. So I need one more spark plug. Hey, yo! Now we failed miserably. It gave us a whole other extra little bit and it's like, oh God, we're not going to get anywhere. Uh, and it, yeah, we had invisible words and it was, it was just all kinds of slightly nightmarish, whereas this is also nightmarish, but at least slightly more navigable. Okay, so it seems like when it goes to two arrows like that, we can zoom in. Useful to know. Hang on, A plus L. Ah, hello, we got a battery. 
<laughs> I wonder what it was trying to tell us about A plus L. Right. Okay, does that mean that we can do other stuff with A plus L? We can open the drawers. Start at the bottom. These drawers are exceedingly disgusting. I do not like. They look gross, but there may be something in one of them. No. That was a shame. But hey, we know how drawers open now. <gasps> oh, hang on. One, four, seven, eleven. That's not going to work. So what do we have? We've got twenty-two, thirty-seven. No, and then we had four, five, three, zero. Nope. And then we've now we've got one, four, seven, eleven. Why do they look like they've got blood inside them? I can't get to that bottom drawer. Okay, so progress. We unscrewed a thing and we need... So we've got a battery. Ah, we've got a battery. Can we put a battery in this? Because it doesn't seem to work. Probably not. That won't work, yes. Um, we can't zoom in on that. Okay, so we've now got another code, 14711. We've still got this calendar. Which gives us way more numbers than we need. We've got several pin code pads. Feel free to make suggestions. This, this is, I, I'm happy for this to be a collaborative game because honestly, I think that's how we get out. Um, I still need one more um, fuse thing. Ah, maybe we can open this drawer now. No. We've still got a button. Don't know what that does. I don't know why we want to unplug a fan, but hey. We can't move the dumb waiter. That is locked. That is locked. We've got a poster. Um And we have a battery as well as a calendar now. Um and there is no music. I don't know why it has a music thing if there's no music. Um, that confuses me a lot. Basically seems to be stuck in like the back room of a cocktail bar. Someone's office. We need to figure out how to get that to turn on. Um. So yeah, the main thing I'm looking for is another fuse thing, another spark plug, so that I can yeah, 
I can't open this drawer. Um, so that I can figure out, so I can press that button as well. So, yeah, we clearly picked a wrong brain day to do this. Or, yeah, I just, I'm much better doing escape rooms with groups. But we'll give it an hour. God, I hope we don't get stuck in this room for an hour. Um, I feel like it should have... Or maybe it does have music. Maybe it's just very low. Ah. Does that give you music now? I've got it turned down on my end, but as long as there's something on the stream. It looks like it's got sound, so I'll take that. Um... Oh dear. Okay, so we've got several things, right? Ah, it's broken. Okay. Oh! Biggest fan. I got an achievement. There's a slider on the fan. Okay, we did something! <laughs> Yay! There's barely any sound. You see, the thing is that I turned it down because I didn't want loud music, and now it's like there's no music. So we'll put it there. Yeah, I'm very glad I put the timer on. Um, I think that sound is just very low music and the fan. I don't want to turn it up too loud, but I'll see if I can bump it a little bit more. I think the game is just quite quiet. Okay. So now we figured we can hold... To be fair, I think I figured it out with this button. Don't know what the button does. Usually you'd have a friend who would be like, you press the button and there's a thing. And I don't know why I'm trying to break the fan. I really want to know what this disgusting thing is, or I don't want to know what this disgusting thing is. But yeah, it said something about needing a knife, or need to cut the wires. We don't have anything to do that with. But hey, we've made some progress. So yes, yeah, so we're looking for one more spark plug. Now I know I can, like, move things. I'm just wondering if I can move any other things. And I don't know why, I don't actually, I picked up a spark plug and I don't actually know where from, which is always interesting. I really want to open this drawer, but it won't let me. Um, I think that's a can. So. But now knowing that I can do stuff like that, can I open a box? No, I think it was just there was a spark plug there. Can I literally do the door handle? No. Okay. I think I like it best when it doesn't have the timer. Um, okay. 
So. There are some colours. Green, yellow, black, red. There's a TV which I can't switch on. I can't see what this thing is, but it makes a funny noise. Which is probably really loud now. We we have one four seven eleven, which could correspond to January, April, July, November, which does not make a word or anything. But it definitely won't fit in any of these keypads, of which we now have four, though one doesn't have any power. Um There was a battery in there. Don't know what we need the battery for. Um, yes, yeah, so we have four keypads, of which we've not managed to solve anything. <sighs> Maybe I talk out loud and then someone will have an idea. Basically, if you have an idea or a thought or even just an inkling, please do share. With our magic moving thing, we can't move this. Maybe because we don't have any power? But yes, I'm still missing one spark plug. So if you do spot anything that look, could look like a spark plug, let me know. Lots of stuff is locked. And then we have this poster. Which could be a clue. We can zoom in on it. It feels like it should be a clue. Um, but if it is, I don't know. Excuse me. Um, so. Right. Right. Okay. Um, I'm just going to quickly nip to the youth room. Four times faster and five times cooler seems significant. I'm going to leave it on the poster, actually. And then just quickly nip to the bathroom. Um, but yeah, we've got like three four digit lock things panels one in a drawer one on the side of the drawer and one on the panel at the back there's a code for the exit door as well but that's not enabled so i'll be back in a minute or two I am very tempted to try that Nescape game again on like Saturday or something before I do some power wash. Just or I may just do it on my own type thing. Um and see. Um But yeah, anyway, we've got one achievement. And we did complete the game, it just we didn't get all the things, so you know. So, right. Ugh. Okay. One, four, seven, eleven. Good numbers. Okay, so we've got the Mark II. Four times faster, five times cooler. Three modes of destruction. Zero waste. Ten times something instantly one something one something and then includes four batteries one charging cell 
controller and a set of seven something. No. Cable six meters long. Right, hang on. One charging cell. Cable six meters long. Possibly one something. There are like 13 numbers here. I wonder if that just completely out of the blue thought corresponds to the numbers in here. So mark two was four times something, five times something, and then three was the next one because we did four five three zero. Um so zero would be five and then it was ten one one so seven then would be one and then it had oh crap so we've got two three one I need to count number eleven okay so one two three four five six seven eight nine ten 11 is the 6 that I c can barely see, but it, it looks like 6 meters. At least I think it's 6 meters, so we'll try that. Something happened! Oh! We picked something up, or did something. Oh! We seem to have opened up... Aha! Spark plug! And that one's still locked. Okay. We did something on there. I don't know what it was. We didn't seem to pick anything up, so maybe we just unlocked something. Anyway, we have our final spark plug, so I'm happy. But you're right, Dan. Was it Dan? I think it was Dan that said something about the lots of numbers. Yay, what do we got? Ooh! A battery and a black light. Light reveals things that are invisible, but do we need to put a battery in it? Oh, I've put the battery in it. I've apparently put the battery in. Okay, cool. Um, see something faint on it. Ooh, everything's glowing blue. All of a sudden. Oh, no, it says 2446. Okay. Right, let's put that into one of these. Because, you know, we've got several of the damn things, so... 24... What was it? 2446. I need a memory like a sieve. If it's not 2446, then I will... Oh, that did something. What did that do? Oh, it opened that. Oh, hello, we've got something in here. Right, we have a rhombus key. Okay, now we're... Oh, hang on, key. Uh, right, I was going to say, I saw a, a rhombus shape. Ah! Aha! Uh -huh. We're making progress! The batteries are behind, I know, right? Now we've got some pliers! Great! We can go cut the wires over here. Because to me, that's what that means. It may not be very safe, but hey, that's to me what that, that means. Hey! The fan stopped! Fan is... Oh, hello! It's got some numbers on. Uh, three, six, two, eight... No, that's not a... No, that's a four. Four, six, two, eight. Or possibly two, eight, four, six or something. Right, okay. Yay, it's to you. Cool, all right, okay. So what was it? Two, eight, four, six. That did something, yes? No, yes. I need to try and... Oh! Jesus Christ, it opened to me. Oh, hey, hey. Excellent. 
And then, what on earth is this? Oh, switches, right. Okay. Um, oh, this reminds me of that. Okay, so... Is it one, four, eight, ten, twelve? Oh yes, it does. It's also got the numbers underneath. Well, that did something. What did that do? This is the only thing. It's like I've done something, but I don't know what I did. It's like I pressed a button under the thing, and I don't know what I did. Um, but hey, we've got a key, and this has a lock. So could we try this? Yeah, if you can get another puzzle one before I do the alien game, then... Ooh, hello. I've got some buttons now. Oh, okay. It's doing something. Got something there. Okay, what happens if I put the other buttons? Depends on how Games of War are in G pipes. Okay, cool. You've probably got at least an hour at this point. Now, what did I just pick up? Uh, remote. Okay. Ooh, hello. We had some colours on the drawer. Maybe that'll work with that. I need to turn around to get that. An optical device. I don't know what that is. Okay, um, right. Draw. Okay, so we've got green, yellow, black, orange, green, yellow, or maybe it's purple, orange. Well, that did something, and I got a bloop. Colours! Got wrong. Solve the colour puzzles. Right, now. Yay. Hey, and we've got a, a whisk. A strange tool. Oh, it looked like... Um... Tongs! <laughs> I'm just gonna do that until something happens. Yeesh. Right, okay. Now what do I need to do? I don't know. I was trying to see if I could move along to stick the little tongue things in the electric socket, but apparently what I did was take the numbers out of the keypad. Oh, I wonder if I can put them in the exit. Oh, okay. Right. Ooh, hello. Seven. Five. Three, nine. Ah! Progress. I don't think I was within whatever time limit, but that was slightly more satisfying. Oh, right, crap, it's a bit loud. That was slightly more satisfying than the um, other room. Okay. Oh, okay. Right, what have we got? Got something there. Don't know what it is, but hey, I can pick it up. Oh, I can look at what it is. All right, we're making some progress. Okay, info tablet. Ooh, symbols to numbers. Good. Um, we've got something there. What is that? It is a bottle of absinthe. Cool. We can't zoom in on any of that, so um, we can zoom in there though. Um, right. 
Yeah, that one just started, things started happening. Ooh, okay. That's a little something. It's a wire. Excellent. It's a tiny little wire. Ooh, a grabby thing. Power cell rod. Some lockers with codes. It's locked. No, really? Okay. We open that up. We've got, yeah, so. Got a TV screen. Lockers with codes. Right. Oh, button, button, button. Power's down. Okay, so I've got to get the power back up. Right. Quite chuffed we managed to get out of that other room. I feel like my faith in my escapeness is, you know. Um. Restored. Okay, right. So let's have a look at what we've picked up. Ooh, that's the wire. Bottle. Let's have a look at the bottle. Ooh, hello. 8731. Okay. Yep, yeah, I know it's locked. I'm trying to put the numbers in. Ah, excellent. Oh, some scissors. Always good. Photo tablet. Okay. Some scissors. Ow. Hmm. Okay. Hmm. We've got three achievements. Complete within the time limit. Hmm. I wonder... <laughs> Clever. Oh, I don't think there's anything in there. Oh my gosh, I'm having zoom issues. There's nothing in there, but that was totally worth it for the meta game. Oops, my doors went into each other. You put the code in and it gives you achievement. <laughs> uh, oh, right, we have scissors. We had a box. Maybe we can get into the box. That's what usually I do with scissors. Excellent. Ooh, hello. We've got some symbols. Um, right. No, they don't quite correspond with that. They just look like thingy majiggies. Um, unless there's something in there. Do we still have scissors? I can't get into the box. I wouldn't. Oh, I got a valve. Okay. Uh, ooh, valve. Valve. I saw a thing for a valve over here. I would totally fit in the box. Can't turn it yet. Okay, why not? Um, found a valve. Half-Life 3 confirmed. Yeah. Ow! Right, let's see. Can we... Ah. Ooh, what is that? Power cell picker. Um, that was a power cell. Power cell rod. Bottle, info tablet. Little wire. Okay, so we lost our scissors. Okay. Um, cool. I didn't expect to be up here and now I'm slightly alarmed. I feel like that's 
antennae or something. Right. Um, yeah, so I feel like we need another or a, a really big orange thing. Um, oh, hello. I could see something shining. Okay, so. Can we just plonk this in the ceiling? Oh, yeah, we can. Excellent. Oh, can we? Do we need to push it in with this thing? No, we just need to put it in the ceiling. Okay. Um. Oh, wait, no. Wait, hang on. No, we've got something. What are we doing? What, 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 what is it doing? Ah, oh, okay, right, red. Ah, my mouse keeps on moving. <laughs> red, green, blue, red, green, blue, okay. Wait, did I see lights? Have I seen lights somewhere? Lights, where are lights? There's gotta be lights somewhere. Um. Okay, it's not going to be a guess. It definitely has to be lights somewhere. Maybe. Right. Is he missing something at the moment? Um. Anyone see light? Mm. Oh, lights! Green, blue. I put the wire. That's what I did. I was like, oh, maybe there's a wire missing. Uh, green, blue, red, blue. Okay, right. Ah. Oh, no, that's already blue, red. Okay. Can I now do this? Yeah, we have power. Ooh, excellent. So we have something on there. Ooh, but we can press this button. More boxes. Ooh, and a panel. Panel which needs a number. We don't have a number yet. What did we pick up? Satellite antenna. Okay. Right, well there was a satellite up here. Maybe then my TV will do something. Ring. Warning. Error 47. Hydraulics pressure too low. Got signal. Hey, we're making some progress. Huh, right, okay. Now uh, what's this? Ooh, okay. We can move these things, all right, okay. No, I've got to do it quick. Okay, so...
One, two, three, four, five. Okay. Oh, hello. Symbols. Right. Now we can use this. Can we just like 50 it over? No. Okay, so there's an H with a dot. Six. Um, fancy thing f seven. Hook with the dots. One. And upside down with two dots. Three. Okay. No! Six, seven. Now that was a lot quicker. Hey, we did something. On time two. Excellent. We'll go back and replay the first room. Um, uh, later. locked. Yes, but it looks like it's got a key in it. Okay. Boxes, they're great. Ah. Um. Aha! I picked something up. What have I got? Looks like a sippy cup. Acetone. Ooh, which looked like it had numbers on. One, three, zero. Okay. Acetone. It's a coil of wire. Excellent. Right. Battery. Hmm. Oh! Okay. Need something to free the legs. Okay, well, we've got acetone. <laughs> Apparently, we just put acetone on. I think it's a table. And now we have two iron bars. Excellent. I feel like we're making some sort of magnet type situation. I don't know whether we needed both of those. Dr. Science! We now have a magnet. Excellent. What do we need a magnet for? Ah, we've got a screwdriver. Okay, now what, what can we screw? <laughs> I just noticed these are probably cameras watching me. Okay, it's 
broken. Why did I break the key? I don't know. Maybe that's why I have a magnet. Oh my god. I have the most, like, ridiculous, um, large battery thing here. Oh, it's missing some parts. Okay. Can we give it that and that? And now we have some bastard wire cutters. Can we use this to get through the fence? Oh! We escaped. Okay, so that was quicker than I expected. That was less than an hour. Okay. So I've not lost my mojo. It was just the other game was tricky. Right, what what do we not have? We don't have Oh, let's just go. Let's just let's just do it all in one. I uh, oh, there we go. Okay. Uh 34 minutes for the first one. Ah. And then 12 and then 5. Ah. <laughs> Oh dear. We, I, I, yeah, let's just replay the first chapter. Um, right, screwdriver. Ah, that's where that thing was that we picked up. Right, okay, so. We have that. Grab battery. And then. Right, so. Um, two, three, one. Oh, yeah, six meters. Another spark plug. Oh yeah, and there was something down here. That was a calendar. Ah, the other spark plug was in here, wasn't it? Right, excellent. Now, let's add some spark plugs. It's a lot easier when you know when where everything is. Black light. Battery in black light. Black light on here. Twenty four forty six. I wonder if we could have just put that code in without needing the black light. We didn't need the TV, that's what threw me. thing uh, um, the poster's fallen down wait hang on did that change there was a, a thing under the poster oh I bet that's what this button does under here that I couldn't figure out what it had done I never noticed what had changed is because I did it before I did anything. Oh, look! Yeah, that's what... Oh, it's nice to solve that mystery. Uh, this stops the fan. Um, I think I can remember the code. It's like 2486 or something. 2846. Uh, 
aqui. One L shape. Missed out that, that one. Not that one. I forget what that does, but anyway. Um. Green, yellow, purple, orange. Pick this up for the door. Strange tool. Yeah, I don't know what that does. Anyway, close the door, steal the numbers. And then we will have a short break before we go looking for aliens. Seven, five, three, nine, seven, five, three, nine. Voila! 100% complete. I feel like that is more point and click puzzle. Because, you know, combining inventory things, point and click. Um, right. So, that is 100% on that. So... What I'm going to do is go, I liked that one because it was a little bit more, I could see what I was looking at. Um, as opposed to the Nescape one where it's like, I can't figure out how to make my inventory work. <laughs> Excuse me. Um, so that one, yeah. That one felt slightly more intuitive, which is good because this is the same people that are making the one that I'm playing with ID um, tonight in like an hour and a half. Um, so that's that bodes well that um, it is uh, slightly more intuitive. I need to get more tea. So yes, what I'm going to do is briefly flip up the end screen so that I can end this segment. Um, not that it particularly matters, but I like it. And then I'm going to go to the break screen while I go make some tea that is hot. And then we will go to the third game of the stream, which will be a hidden object looking for aliens puzzle. Um, yeah, thank you again to I did Xbox for the code for this one. I don't know whether I said it, so I'm just gonna end end it, say it now. Um, <laughs> aliens is cute, cool. I, I thought we'll end with some cute, cozy. Don't have to escape from a room for at least another hour and a half. <laughs> but yeah, that one definitely felt more intuitive with things, even if it was kind of hard to figure out some of the interactions because I didn't pay attention to the instructions. That would have been more sensible. Um, but that was a nice, you know, just over an hour actual time type thing. That was, that was good. That seemed 
just slightly more intuitive. Not that I had anything against the Nescape one. It's just I spent 20 minutes looking for stuff when I could have put a number in a clock and continued. And then it got so close to the end, I was just too flustered by the timer and couldn't think straight on the candle stuff. Um, so I will go back and get to that point with more time on the clock and see if I can figure out the candle solve and I will let her all know how it ends. <laughs> because yes, I'm sure I could solve it. I just, yeah, this is why I am not good at escape room solo. Though this one was okay. Though I did get a wee bit stuck until I, until I think it was Dan mentioned the numbers on the poster. And I was like, there's a lot of numbers on the poster. And then maybe the numbers are clues. I don't know. So, yeah. Right, so we're just going to quickly flush the end screen up. We're not ending. I just want to letterbox this VOD. So, thank you for this game, and I'll see you in a moment.